right now we're pulling about 448 to the rear wheels. Oh my god. So okay, here we go. When you pulled in right now, like, yeah, you're not. What's going on YouTube? SRT Dad here, and today we're gonna meet with, with uh, Mike. Mike drives a, a newer gen, I don't know exactly what year. It's a F8 green Dodge Charger RT with a few goodies on it. And if I can recall, he told me a, he had a dynoed at 400 wheel horsepower. Uh, we'll, I'll make sure to double check when we meet up with him. But uh, he is also a fitness trainer and I believe he used to compete uh, as a bodybuilder. So he should be an interesting guy to meet. Can't wait to meet him. I'll see you guys when we get there. Let's go. What's up, man? <laughs> All right, who do we got here, man? Mike, Mike, or Polk Hemi, 2022 Polk on Hemi. Instagram. Luis Beltran, man, nice to meet you. Nice SRT meet you, dad. Nice. All right, man, what do we got here? 2022 Dodge Charger RT. Nothing fancy about it. Looks pretty stock. Yeah. <laughs> it looks, it looks stock, yeah. I tell everybody it's 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 more of a getter when it comes to the motor. Yeah. I've, uh, had a stage two custom cam installed to it. Long okay. tube headers. Okay. Cold air intake system. Redid the rear end. Redid the entire exhaust. Um, had it done at Dyno Comp. Right now we're pulling about 448 to the rear wheels. Oh my god! So it's uh, it's it's a get up and go Dude. kind of a car. I love Dude. it. So RT 2022 yes. making 448. Yes sir. Wow. <laughs> yes sir. Wow. I, I That's think insane, it's, man. Yeah, it's 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 awesome. I'm not gonna lie. I, yeah. It's one of the probably the best cars I've ever had, and I tell everybody I'll get rid of every girlfriend and wife I have until I get rid of the car. <laughs> Uh -oh. oh man! Don't post that part. <laughs> oh man! So we got this Hulk steering wheel. Yes, you mind? Sir. You mind if I step oh, on it? Look at this wheel, man. It's, it's real good. Oh. So I used to have a, a 17 RT uh -huh. like five years ago before I got my uh, SRT8. So I like. I prefer, honestly, I prefer these cloth seats. Yeah. Because they're a lot more durable. Yep. Uh, they could take a beating and they just stay clean, man. Like they always stay clean and they don't wrinkle because it's not leather. Yeah, leather and Eric and AZE is just not. My ass sticks to it. You sweat too much. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, <laughs> exactly. So, man, the, I like the Hulk thing, man. Yeah, it's it's. I mean, you kind of look like yeah. kind of look like Hulk, bro. Well, thank like, you, I appreciate like it. Like the, uh, the the second version of a Hulk when he's kind of <laughs> more calmed down. Yes, he I know it's crazy. I'm wearing shirts now. Yes. You know what I mean? So. <laughs> But yeah, no, I, I've, you know, got this car brand new, and like I said, it's, it's been a fun, fun adventure yeah. ever since then. So yeah, you, you mind uh, uh, popping the hood oh, no, open? Not at all. See the long tubes in there. Like I said, you look at it; it's all stock. Uh, it, it, we can hear it though. When you, when you pulled in right now, like, you don't yeah, hear nothing. It's all stock. It's, all <laughs> it's dirty and everything. I tell people, I just try keeping everything looking as bad as possible, yeah, so you so, don't know what's going on with it. So you you daily the crap out of it, you said, I right? Do. Yes, so sir. 2022, and you said you, you just hit 62,000 miles. 62, miles, miles. Yeah. Like I said, this is my fun daily driver. Yeah. It's funny because I was actually looking at getting a little Fiat since, you know, Dodge and Fiat are pretty much owned by the same company. Right, right. So I have a couple of friends of mine that own Ford and they're like, oh, you just drive a souped up Fiat. I said, <laughs> Give me a minute, I'll own one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That'll be my daily driver. And then this will just sit in the garage so I can tinker on it all the yeah. time. But so yeah. so who who built the car? Uh, Dino Comp. Dino we Com. actually you had said them over yeah. in the East Coast, right? Yeah, they're well no, East Valley. East Valley. Yeah, oh, Scottsdale. East Valley. Oh, oh yeah, wow. Scottsdale. Okay, Scottsdale. Yeah, they uh they're the ones that actually have done all the work to it. Oh okay. man, they've uh they've come through with it when it comes to getting everything done on yeah. it. If I had any issues, I just take it back to them and they take care of everything. Okay. So, so 448's really... the wheel. Uh how much how much money drop on it? <laughs> <laughs> um i would probably say anywhere between 15 to 17 grand okay so okay yeah between the rear end the cam yeah. the, everything else that i've done to it the custom yeah the, the exhaust the lowering at two inches the steering wheel 
everything about yeah. 15 to 17. That's not bad. That's not no. bad. Um, I chose the 5.7 because I just know it's a motor that can handle anything I want yeah. to do to so it. So I'm assuming MDS to leave, right? Yes. No, oh, no yes. MDS. Okay. Yeah. And then at the end of the day, I got everything set up to where if I decide I want to dump a supercharger on it, it'll hold it. Okay. So, yeah. uh, Okay. The, the internals? Yep. All of it. I have the new, new crank. I've had a new uh, new high high performance oil pump, all that stuff installed. Okay. okay. So yeah, they've done everything oh, yeah. they can. So See? basically all we got to do at this point is if I want to put a supercharger on it, that's just the next step. Yeah. Oh, so wow. everything yeah. else is done she, to she's it. She's ready to go. Yes, so this sir. is a super built I said. Yes, man. sir. Oh my God. You mind starting her up again? Not at all. I don't think auto started with the hood open. No. <laughs> I learned that. I learned that the hard way. <laughs> You did? Had zero miles on it. The first thing I did was take it over to them and said, let's just destroy every warranty we possibly can. <laughs> and we did, did it. You did it right. We did it right. Uh, how much was it back then? Uh, I got it out the door for about 37 yes, five. Yeah, I got it from, nice on my birthday too, actually. they act, I had it built. It took about six months to order it. They actually delivered it the day before my birthday. Yeah. So I got it February 28, 2022. Okay. Yeah, that, that's, yeah, that's a solid price because right now they're, I think, mid-40s yeah. right now, yeah, right? Yeah, about mid-40s. Right? Uh, probably 50 out the door yeah right? yeah but yeah i love Sweet. it and it had the, the track pack put on it and everything like that so it's it's awesome Sweet. Sweet. had a couple questions for mike man what do you do for a living i'm a personal trainer and i'm actually a gym owner a gym so, owner yeah I own oh, a wow. gym called rise above health and fitness on okay. 49th Definitely avenue shout that out yeah yeah so it's actually really cool but yeah i'm a personal trainer and i actually am an amateur bodybuilder well classic physique competitor okay what we I call mean... ourselves so i'm actually getting ready for a competition in the next eight oh, weeks. Oh, so you're still currently competing? Oh, yeah. Okay. You know, okay. Listen, keep, it's funny to tell everybody, but it keeps me sane. <laughs> uh, you know what? I you know, I'm not, you know, I'm not like you, man. But I definitely, I work out and stuff. And, yeah. Yeah. It's, I mean, I got three kids and all that, so. Yep. None. It keeps you sane. <laughs> hey, good for you, man. Good for you. <laughs> I got smart on that one. I dropped all those fucking bullets. <laughs> <laughs> man, I got a car seat in the back seat right now, See? man. <laughs> Never gonna happen. Uh, <laughs> hey, hey, let's. Hey, what's your favorite pose? Ah, uh, front double bicep. Let's see it. Okay. Let's see it, man. <laughs> <laughs> like the shirt too. Ooh, oh man. <laughs> Eat ass game, man. <laughs> You know, I didn't even read it till now, man. <laughs> exactly. I walked through so many places. And they're like, wait, what's your shirt? Like, Don't say it out that's, loud. That's that's awesome, man. Yes, that's sir. awesome, man. I'm gonna, right, I'm gonna take a few pictures and record a couple videos of uh, the parts together.
Not bad, man. Not bad. Thank so, like, like I keep telling everybody, I have no idea how much power I'm making. Yeah. No, that so, thing goes, man. Yeah. So, I dyno. This is at 3.99. This is what I try to explain to people. Okay. Um, I had cats when I last dynoed the car. Yeah. But, uh, but uh, I was tuned, I was tuned to be catless. Got it. So, so I was running on the wrong tune for the car. I contacted my tuner, and the reason I went cat, I back cat is because I was being a pussy, right? Yeah. I was scared of the noise. I was like, that is too loud for me. <laughs> I had never been in a cam car, yet alone catless. Yeah. My thing was shaking like crazy. Honestly, it scared me at of first. I'm not going to lie. It scared me. I was being a pussy. So I put cats on, but I didn't get retuned. Yeah. So I was running catted without a retune. Yeah, with a catless too. So when they told me, I was like, hey, you know what I mean? The, but going, getting a, going with that with the high flow cats I had on, I said it won't affect. It might not affect it on the low RPM, but on the high, high RPM, end. high end. It will. That's where your tune really like. That's Keeps where it in. makes all its power, especially you know being cammed and long tube headers. So I went back catless. I never got dyno again, but my original dyno was at about 425 okay. wheel. And this was, a, a, I call it, a, a, this is a corrected dyno. So okay. a corrected dyno means there's like a certain standard for uh, temperature and yeah. all that stuff that it makes it fair to get like the, the realest number yeah. you can get. This is what my, my tuner told me. Yeah. So they told me, hey, it might you know, be rated at 425 here. But you go to another dyno, it might be higher. Yeah. It might be lower. All depends. Uh, on everybody it. says dyno is is just a number. Yeah. At the funny. end of the day, like a car might make more than another, but it's like you, you won't find out until you do a quarter mile, or you know what I mean, or yeah. you go head to head against somebody. So yeah, I don't really. You're the first person I've ever gone head to yeah. head with. Yeah. I don't so really, you, I don't do and then also too, there's the driver mods. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. I'm not used to it. Like I yeah. said, that was the first and, time. And he did tell me prior, he's like, hey, you know, I'm not used to doing this. You know I, mean? I just, I like having fun. I do. Things. I like yeah. just going if I yeah. want to go and stopping yeah. if I want to stop. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but that was, man, that was, that was really fun. Oh, man, this thing is nice. Thank you. I, I really want to get another RT. Just because I, I love the crap out of my yeah. RT. Like, just... I really did. And unfortunately, I crashed it. You know what I mean? I didn't feel like getting the same car again. Yeah, when it no, happened. I get yeah. it. No, I completely understand. Yeah, but I, I do want to get another one. You know, everybody was like, "Why don't you go with a Hellcat?" I'm like, "Yeah, <laughs> yeah." Uh, <laughs> like multiple reasons, but I also just think yeah, 707 horsepower to the rear. I mean, fuck. I mean, you spend more time spinning tires than yeah. you're going. Yeah, and I don't know if you know, like these, these Hellcats are getting stolen a lot. Lately. Oh, big time. Yeah, big, big time. time. It's like really easy. So it's easy when you have an RT, like I said. Yeah, they don't see a Hellcat. No. They see the RT. Like, all right, we don't. Yeah, we don't, we don't want, want that. It's just yeah. a typical Charger. Yeah, it looks stuck. Actually, yeah, it looks stuck. I was, <laughs> was going to put a V6, V6 sticker on just, both of my cars just so people fucking leave me alone. <laughs> yeah. So just to make sure, be like, yeah, it's just a V6. People, leave me alone. Yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 it's well, really anyways, Mike, I really appreciate your no time, worries, man. man. It was a great I time, man. You. Thank it you, sir. Nice meeting you, nice man. Meeting I really you enjoyed my too. time with you, man. It was a good time. If I uh, he taught me a few things about you know fitness and eating right because you know I, I don't necessarily eat right. <laughs> uh, but then again, I have kids and he doesn't. This is true. Him. Yeah, don't. <laughs> nah, well, you already you want, had that problem. You want to be swole? Don't have kids because he has to eat freaking Cheerios for dinner. Yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. I'll eat Cheerios every now and then for dinner yeah, too. Yeah. If I have a good leg day the next day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what, what's your favorite workout, man? Ah, uh, dude. Honestly, I like back. Back, back is my favorite. I, leg you know, I'll post. Is it mind if I post pictures within the video? Okay. Yeah. So that's that's what I like, man. So I just yeah. I just do pull ups. I try to put like a belt on and put a weight on it, but it's nothing like doing actual. No. I love pull ups. I yeah. do lap pull downs. I do seated lap row, bent over, bent over uh, barbell rows, yeah. back extensions, things like that, man. Yeah. I, I like I have a really nice big back yeah, so I, I like, keep telling my wife when these kids get a little older because I work out in my garage yeah. you know what I mean I just have the basics in there yeah. so I don't have like access to being able to do like lap pull downs I really want my back's tiny bro like I want some wings <laughs> like you I want to be able to glide in the sky that's, like you you just, you just jump in the air right? you like those squirrels <laughs> with the wings you'd be, <laughs> you'd be gliding I'm fucking, through the air I'm heavy so I'll just go <laughs> <laughs> yeah I'm trying I'm trying to get some wings man 
But yeah, I told her, hey, as soon as these kids get older, you know, I'm, I'm gonna get a gym membership again nice. once I have time to really, yeah, really go crazy. Maybe, man, maybe I'll have you train me, man. Hey, come know, over to my me? gym. I yeah. go work you out a couple yeah. of times. Yeah. Like I said, 49th Avenue and uh, Thunderbird. You make me cry, but you yeah. say you don't yell at people no more. I right? don't. No, okay. I gave up that idea. It's, 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 it's very, it's very <laughs> negative to people. They, people don't like being yelled at. All right, at. so they, you guys, if you guys, you know, if you guys want to get swole, you know who to go to. All right. I'll Remember, take care of you. <laughs> eat ass, gain mass. All right. <laughs> all right, man. It was nice meeting you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. That's gonna be it, YouTube. I'm out. SRT Dad!